I'm sick of words. But I'll break my pen in half and resort to ink blots. The most succinct blots. Doctors will have said these will make great Rorschach tests and marvel at how everyone interprets the same thing. I'll publish visible thought bubbles that will pop and drench innocent onlookers. Cursive line, tortuous line, presupposing I could lasso minds or replace your sinews with mine by making sense, but sense is making me deaf, dumb, and blind, confined by sanity. Take me over the Rhine. When I write, cloud nine is a nimbus I hold in the side, interpreting its shape as collated documents, wind blown, it precipitates the ink, don't think but see, see what you say, say what you see. McLeish, a poem should not mean, it should be. The siren in your center sings, go to her, try to read your handwriting later. I really made a mess of things, this page looks like a murder scene with blots bleeding through heart and sleeve. Leave pupils puddles of ink, I'm sick of words. So I'll fill my verse with action verbs, spring, sprang, sprung, fling, flown, flung, wing, wing, one, spit, spat, spittin' image of God. My face is a facade, mid-sneeze, about to blow to smithereens, the shades behind it have not been seen before. Crayola will try to name them, but the words will leave the crayon sleeves. They'll discover that bees have knees and try to name that part of their anatomy after me and I'll say, what do we need to invent more words for? And etymologists will unanimously concur to let them be. Communication is key, but silence is golden. I'm connoting emotions to wordless notions floating your conscious stream, show boating down tributaries, paying tribute to the wordless evolutionary grown out of his mouth like his clothes. There are revolutionaries leading us in circles and evolutionaries taking quantum leaps of faith i'll land in the future among these big-eyed little gray men without mouths and know that ufos are really time machines i've stopped making sense haven't i see this is why i'm done with words language has as much capacity to contain what i mean as steepled roofs can overbear the wild spirit of god flabbergasted by the gall of the clock i'll tell time to stop without a word but a thought unfold without a plot without a twist no tongue for knots the sun is only my emblem coming up in conversation via telepathy no second thoughts tick tock tell not your children to use their words Show them to throw their lights, watch them grow as tall as they burn. My tongue is a flame licking in your ear. It's not an organ, it's an orchid with petals that dance and induce tears. Your bodies are blurs to me. You all look like a mass of fuzzy flesh. I have to use this mouth only to convince you close enough so that our wavy limbs and unsealed torsos start to mesh. My father is a broken stained glass window. I'm one of his refractions. The director of lights hears my prayer, and having said all this, he yells, Action. Thank you, Craig. Thanks for being on our show. That was incredible. You're a brilliant artist and poet. Thanks, y'all. Let's, let's take a bow. Uh, Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. OK. Should we strike this down? Strike that down. Strike this down. Everybody. Yeah, we got to strike it down. Strike it down. Just strike that down. <laughs>